Amen. 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 I want you to play press, and then I'm going to get to the mess. Y'all got to realize you got to press. There's no more laying back. You got to press your way through some stuff. Amen. Amen. Now, sometimes God won't let other people help you press through. You got to know how to press. You got to know how to get to God. Amen. Amen. And so I want you to, I, I want you to hear press. Here we go. Here it comes to the word.
We lose focus, so we quit pressing our way. Amen. 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 We take the world way out, and then the enemy begin to what? To destroy us. And then when you get in the place where nobody there to help you, it's because you went the wrong way. But God said, press your way toward me. I am the way, the truth, and the life. Amen. 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 So I'm going to show you the day in the Word. Amen. And the topic is stay focused. Stay focused. Amen. And I'm going to do the way he told me to do. He, told, he gave it to me three times. He said, stay focused. Stay focused. Stay focused. Stay focused. Stay focused. Amen. He's telling you to stay focused. Amen. If you have to do your hand like that. Stay focused. Come on, y'all get to your head like that. Come on, baby. Come on, brother. Come on, stay focused. Stay focused. Stay focused. Stay focused. Stay focused. And I'm going to show you what the focus is. The world wants you to stay focused on men, but Jesus is going to show you if you stay focused on me, I'm going to keep you out of the man. I'm going to put you in position. I'm going to orchestrate your life if you stay focused. Amen. Amen. You think you broke, but you ain't broke. He said you have not because you were asked not. Amen. Because money is a big issue now. Amen. Folks steal it. Folks yeah. trying to take folks stuff, yeah. but they ain't asking the source. Yeah. The source got the money. Yeah. If you ask, yeah. he's I get you some money. Right. Amen. 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 And I'm gonna show you my focus. Amen. Yeah. I was going to you to go to Mark four, start at verse seven six forty one, and I'm gonna show you these are three examples when Jesus was on the boat with his disciples. Amen. And and how <laughs> my God, my God. Amen. They lost track. Amen. And I'm gonna show you in the word. And then so you know what Jesus told me? He said, I I'm the focus. If they had kept watching me. Mm -hmm. Come on, man. That's right. I'm gonna show you, show you in the word, all right? Y'all have a problem back there, baby doll. I'm trying to follow me. Give them my yes, Amen. Mommy. I'm trying to follow me. Y'all see me. Amen. I thank God. Y'all don't know y'all just open up a womb for me. Amen. Thank you, Lord. God had promised, Amen, prophesied to me that y'all mean you. I'm going to be a blessing to the youth. Amen. Young folks. Yes. So y'all better be young with me. Yes. <laughs> y'all old folks, you right. told me young. Amen. 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 So dumb young men just opened up the womb. Amen. 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 I, I thank God for it. Yes. Amen. 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 Thank God. All right. Let's, let's look at verse 36. Okay. Look what he said. And when they had sent away the multitude, they took him even as he was in the ship. And there were also with him other little ships. Mm -hmm. And there arose a great storm of wind, and the waves beat into the ship, so that it was now full. Okay, I will use the day term. He said there arose a great storm of wind. So that was a hard storm to the point that it brought fear up on us. Mm -hmm. And today society stuff come up on us hard. See yes, so hard that it bring what? Fear yes. up on us. Yes. We feel like God up in the saints. Don't way this thing hit me down and beat me. Like Lena job, it beating Lena. It's <laughs> like a big wave. I'm gonna use you look at that. big wave. That like Lena ship like it's gonna sink. Amen. And 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 it came full. What it mean full? It done come real heavy up on you. Yeah, yeah. It's so full I can't take this no more. Amen. I got to do something. Yeah. I got to do it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The way mm -hmm. they bother me too much now. I got to do something. Mm -hmm. Woo, my God. Look, I'm gonna show you. Come on. 
And he was in the hinder part of the ship, asleep on a pillow. And they awake him, and say unto him, Master, carest thou not that we perish? What we do? Now he right there with us. Uh -huh. He better he asleep. Jesus said, I never leave you, nor forsake you. So Jesus is not disturbed in what you're going through. Right. <laughs>
that even the winds and the sea obey him. Now Jesus showed them they got even scared what Jesus does for them. Right. Mm -hmm. Come on now. <laughs> you can't even believe when Jesus prays you get scared. Mm -hmm. Have you ever been so blessed things go so well for you after a week you ain't got no problem? And you said, Ooh, we, Lord, this can be a head. Right? Ooh, this we. What's going to happen next? And what you did, you just broke the stone, oh, baby. Right? Right. That devil rejoicing in it. Right. You got to go. 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 And control of everything. I thank God how God control of everything. You know, I know this this is a celebration of, of that child that he the child and everybody talking about. You know what? The Lord gave me something. When something is dead, we need to stop celebrating. Yes. Oh, oh, thank you, Lord. It's dead, it's dead. That's right. I, I ain't celebrating no now. Right. 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 Yes. What happened to me yesterday, that day, right. I'm not going to pun over that. No more. That's Amen. dead. <laughs> we bring too much dead stuff up. Right. Mm -hmm. So we can't get free and stay focused. Right. We our lifestyle where we don't went to Amy and somebody bring it up, that's dead. And here you go. Mm -hmm. Ah, yeah. oh, that's gone. Yeah. I done paid that for yeah. five yeah. That's dead. Mm -hmm. I don't live that no more. Yeah. I ain't celebrating no nine more. Yeah. <laughs> I, 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 I hate that they're gone. Yeah. But, they're gone. And, but it was a time and a season for them to go. Yeah. They gone. He said, let me dead, bury the dead. I feel like what is going on today, what wrong with this side is, we serve the most dead stuff, and we have big things for dead stuff, and we need to be celebrating life. Come on now, Pastor. Amen. Ooh, yes. I didn't. If I have, I might have some kids for the family now. I don't know. But they gone. Amen. Jesus told me I will never get when my uh, daddy died. I had to do the service before I left. And you know what the Lord told me? Let the dead bury the dead. You do what I told you to do and you go and die then. I do what I'm supposed to do and I will. Come on, y'all. We, we don't stay focused on life. I don't care if John uh, quit you 20 years ago and he hurt your family. You got to go up there and speak the focus. And let focus give you the right man or woman. Stay focused. Thank you, baby. Did you say that, baby? You got to come on, baby. Get to me. Focus. That's right, baby. I told you God told me, young folks. Boy, me and you can trap. What I can't do, you can do. Focus. I like that. You man, you done stir me up. Amen. Look at Psalm 89 and 9. Look what it says. I'm going to show you what Jesus is going to say. Thou rulest the raging of the sea. And who rules it? Jesus. Thou, he, he what? He rules the raging of the sea. So if he rules the raging of the sea, don't you know he rules over your problems? Amen. <coughs> That's right. That's right. He tells you let him uh, give it to me. I'm going to rule over it. So if he ruling over something, don't he know how to get you out of it? Right. Yes. He know how to put you in position. He know how to set it up. That means that I'm going to do this to you. And you say, 
said, well, I'm going to give it to you, Lord. Amen. He'll let him out and make the folk give to you instead of you giving it to me. Come on. He's the ruler over the sea. Come on. I thank God. Where is your ruling, Jesus? When the waves thereof arise, thou stillest them. He did what? He stilled. He stilled. In my way. You. Get this high. It doesn't got high. He said, I'm going to steal it. Yeah. I'll make it steal mm -hmm. Come on. You ain't got to fight. Just put me in the rain. I like that. Mm -hmm. I remember when I would come back and say, I put Jesus in the rain. Mm -hmm. I can't have it. I said, Jesus, get in the rain. But right. You said, bitch, is yours. You said, whatever, right, you're going to pay. Amen. I just got to keep the faith and belief that he's going to do what he needs. And I'm telling you, he's working it out, don't you? He's working it out. Well, I thought I couldn't find him. I don't found him. Amen. Come on, y'all. The Holy Ghost is working out. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. And I'm going through the next answer. Come on, y'all. I'm trying to show you Amen. if you stay focused. Oh. Don't look at your problem. Right. Look at the problem solved. This is what he was telling the disciples. They thought they waving and it's storming. Don't mean all you got to do is call on me. Say, folks, oh. look at me. I'm sure you, you can trust me in your ways, in your problem. Oh, my God. Stop looking at the problem. Look at the problem solved. Oh, yeah. my God. Say, Oh, oh okay. Ooh, my God. Show them what a bad. Yeah, baby, you're going right. Turn to go in, not turn back to your left. Amen. Amen. <laughs> Stay focused. Ooh, my God. Y'all now go to Psalm 107 and show you something there. And yeah, you see. If you say he how much control we have. You know we find sometimes we think we control stuff. You ain't controlling nothing. Mm -hmm. The control is the focus. Amen. My God, amen. I was talking, I asked him about my grandson James. Now he's big. He's a big boy. And he doesn't think he's such a bad man. He's a man, he said. He's a man. And he feel like I get my boys, I take care of him. He's a man. He's a man. He thinks he's a man. But when the time comes, the <laughs> man, uh -huh. when my prayer like going to bring him and let him know he ain't the man. Uh -huh. What I'm trying to say is, you don't rule nothing. Uh -huh. You can't do nothing. He is your sword. Uh -huh. So he said, stay focused. Uh -huh. If you want things to change, talk to the focus. Yeah, come uh -huh. on now. Uh -huh. See, the focus, it might look like it's all out of whack. Uh -huh. Like it ain't going your way. And they say, you know, you know why it ain't going to tonight ain't going to work? Because he gonna work on you first. Right, right. So go when he bring the chain, so you can be able to accept the chain. Cause sometimes some things that you need to be broken. And then when he did person or whoever get focused and he thought he acting like godly, can you stand a godly man? So when he speaks to the storm or anything you praying for, when he speaks to it coming down, he gonna set it up the way he spoke to it. That's right. Oh, that's Come right. on now, yeah. Yeah. you get what I'm saying? It's gonna be said the way he speaks to it. Come on. Come on, you better focus. Because you got to make sure I'm right too. They focus when he focuses it out, right? Come on. When you used to be in the head of your own house, you used to pay your own bills and you doing that. Can you humble yourself to be that focused woman? Why? I'm like, oh, All right. Come on now. I want you to stay focused. That's right. See, this is what Jesus was saying. Oh, oh, a little faith. No faith. 
Come on, I want y'all to see. I, I didn't know you were carrying it that way, but he did. Thank you, Lord. Because <laughs> some of y'all are trying to get your life together, but you got to realize how focused you got to yeah, stay. Right thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. My God, let look at look look at Psalm 107, 28, 29. Look at what it says. I'm gonna show y'all something. Then they cry unto the Lord in their trouble. What we do? Cry to the Lord when we are in We cry to the Lord when we in trouble. All right, here yeah. are we focused on the Lord? He be crying out. Look what happened. And he bringeth them out of their distress. Now he bring you what? Out, out of their distress. He bring you out of it. When you stay in what? Focus. And I know sometimes, let me show you something about us. We cry out to God that God bring us out of our stuff. When he bring you out of what we do, we get on what? I'm focused. We get on focus. Yes. We start back doing the same thing that we was already he done took you out of. Instead of staying focused. You got to stay focused. Because he knows that it's going to be another storm coming up in your life. Then you're going to go right back to the same thing. Oh. Oh. This time, you ain't looking at it. And right. Then you begin to pick up a hat. Come on, y'all. Other gods begin to get in your way. All of a sudden, a friend come out, man. I know you're going through something. He got his ball in the back of his mouth. <laughs> come on, take a drink. It'll calm your nerves. <laughs> then you gonna pick up what? A hat. And, and, and that God is what it does. It makes you deeper in trouble. Unfocused. So more unfocused you get, then you start losing stuff. Is that making sense? You got to stay focused. Then you end up, when you start losing stuff, then you find yourself doing things you regret. Then you start lowering your standards. Amen. I hate to say it. A lot of women losing their standards. Yes, They ain't trusting the focus of who they They focus on their money making. Mm -hmm. You know what your money making is. That's wrong. <laughs> I can could, I could get real deep with it. Amen. But I'm going to say your money maker. Right. Oh. We start using our money maker. And don't really realize you are focused on something that's a, a deadly God. You in a way, yeah. 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 a God, thank you, a God of death. Yeah. Yeah. And he's a God of what? Life. Mm -hmm. A lot of people don't want to hear this. But I'm telling you the truth. Y'all mean you stay focused. I don't care how many buddies you got, you stay up and they say, man, let's go out here and, and steal in your soul. You run. That you tell, I'm just using this as a dump. Don't let nobody get you off focus because God already got your life predestinated and perfect. Amen. Thank you, Lord. So he here, don't go back. Okay, look Amen. what he said. Oh my God. Verse 30. He made it the storm a calm. So that the ways thereof are still. He did what? He made it the storm and calm, so that the ways thereof are still. So he he's in control. Yes. He's telling you I control the storm, the wind. I control it. Yes. Lena, you might be going through this for a little season, but I'm in control of this. Yes. So when you get where you stop letting it rock you. You know how we do that wrong. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Which kind of thing you bound back? Uh-huh. When you stop rocking, rocking like and they call the band, but you know, when you stop rocking and get calm, you know, then you gonna do it like this. You know how rock. Right. You stop rocking, and then you your rock gets sick. Yeah, you go back. You going back. You, you, then you go you going back or now. You ain't rocking so you're gonna fall it down. Next thing you know, 
It's over. Amen. 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 Come on now. Amen. I thought I was going to do a little stuff something today to show you how we do, you know. You start rocking. You know. Start rocking with the storm. And you know, come on, call it bark. Bark with me, baby. Bark with my problem, you know. I'm barking today. What's wrong with you, Ryan? The red car. He told me. He, I go, I told you why. He said, stay focused, stay focused, stay focused. Then he told me to tell you, focus was in the ship. All right, let's go to Matthew 8. My God. 8. 8. My God. My God. 18. Um, 18 to 26. Up there, he said, they didn't have no faith. Now, let me show you what you're going to say down here. Let me see. Eight started verse eighteen. Now, when Jesus saw great multitudes about him, he gave commandment to depart unto the other side. Mm -hmm. And a certain scribe came and said unto him, Master, I will follow thee whithersoever thou goest. Mm -hmm. And Jesus said unto him, The foxes have holes, and the birds of the air have nests. But the Son of Man had not where to lay his head. See, this is what he's telling. This is what wrong people today. They think Jesus ain't nowhere in this. Because they can't see him. Mm -hmm. That's why he said, I want verse 20. He said, Jesus said unto them, The fox have hope. See, the fox got place to mm -hmm. And the birds of there have a nest. But the Son of Man have nowhere to lay his head. You know why he don't have no place to lay? Because he didn't let him lay on the inside of us. So he don't have a place. He don't have a place in your life because he ain't got nowhere to lay. Come on now. That's why he didn't have, that's why he said that the son of man has nowhere to lay his head. Because we don't let him lay. He don't have a place in us. So if he don't have a place in us, he don't have a place to what? Lay his head. But he do exist. Yes. Yes. But he's telling them, I don't have no place. Because if I don't receive him, he don't have no place. It's just like I use that for you, bro. You trying to befriend me. But if I keep rejecting you, what happens? He, don't, he can't be befriend me. So he don't have no place with me. This is what Jesus said. I ain't got no place because you won't let me lay my head. I can't be the head. Come on, oh my God. I can't be the head. Yes. I'm the head of your life, but you won't let me be the head. So I ain't got nowhere to lay. I can't lay my anointing on your problem because you won't let me be the head. You want to talk the problem, so I can't be the head. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, yeah. Come on, y'all. Yeah. That didn't drop from heaven. I didn't even see that. Yeah. <laughs> now, that's a revelation from above. Yeah. I'm telling you, he just dropped that in my head, and I dropped it to you. Yeah. He can't be the head. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so he wants to be the head. The only way 
can't hit me in the head, you got to stay focused. Right. My God. Sometimes we say, my wife, my husband, won't do what they supposed to do. Then you ain't letting him be what? Yes. <laughs> and then God all be focused. Come on. Mm -hmm. All right. Let me show you. Let me show you. Okay. Come on, Lynn. And another of his disciples said unto him, Lord, suffer me first to go and bury my father. So we got what? Excuses. Yeah. Yeah. When he tried to be the head, mm -hmm. <laughs> he tried to be the head, we go and say, Lord, let me, <laughs> let, let me go, let me go bury something. Let me go in the kitchen and cook that the fresh fries right quick. Then I'll come back. Come on. But he told us come on. I don't know. But Jesus said unto him, Suffer me first to go and bury my father. And the dead bury their dead. So he telling you, follow me. He means stay faithful and let that whatever you console that got you all upset and confused and all mixed up and all bouncing. <laughs> he said, let it go. go. It's dead. Buried. <laughs> Instead of <laughs> rocking with it. <laughs> What's your problem? I'm rocking. You have seen <laughs> you, you say, how are you doing? They tell you all their problems. Right. And you said, oh, oh God. God. Hey. Instead of seeing life, mm -hmm. they rocking me. Mm -hmm. Come on. So he, what did he told me? To let, he told me to let the dead bury the dead. And what happened? And when he was entered into a ship, his disciples followed him. And behold, there arose a great tempest in the sea. So this one was worse than them. Look at the, the adding the field, what you're going through. I want you to see. But you got to stay focused. What God is saying to you, something's going to be worse on you than the others. But you still stay focused. This problem might like try to make you kind of do like that. But you stay focused. All right, look what it says. In so much that the ship was covered with the waves. But he was asleep. Now the ship was covered with waves. That means it was water everywhere. Your problem could be everywhere. You might have now one problem, you might have four. <laughs> that, that, it looks like good. Uh, look, every time I look around, that's fine. Mm -hmm. Oh, God, look at that. Oh, my children, they acting crazy. Mm -hmm. I got to go to the school now. Oh, my job acting crazy. The Lord have mercy. Mm -hmm. Oh, Lord, here come the bill collector. They call, I ain't got no money for you. Then here comes somebody talking about, let's borrow a couple of flowers. He, I just got a half a bag. <laughs> 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 yeah, so. All the All of this done come up. Mm -hmm. Ooh, Lord, it's got me nervous. I'm trembling, <laughs> waiting for Jesus to take these ways. Yeah. <laughs> yes, Lord. Here it goes. Now, what happened? And his disciples came to him and awoke him, saying, Lord, save us. We perish. Oh, God, I'm perishing. Look where you And he said unto them, Why are ye fearful? Oh, ye of little faith. He said, oh, ye of little faith. And you know why we have such little faith? Because we are not learning to know Him. We are not reading about Him. So we don't know enough about Him to trust Him. Okay, I use, I'm going to use Reggie as that. Me and Reggie is his name. I don't see the Reggie as a neighbor. I see the Reggie as my son. Mm -hmm. Although I don't, I'm not in Reggie's face all the time. Mm -hmm. But I watch Reggie enough mm -hmm. to know when something wrong with Reggie. Mm -hmm. <coughs> you see what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Although Reggie hadn't talked to me, but I know him enough mm -hmm. to know something ain't right. Mm -hmm. I don't have to be in his face 
to pray for him. Amen. Come on. So I realized, like Jesus said right here, I realized Fred rarely uh, have oh, a look of faith. Come on, I'm going to show you something. Amen. Instead of me, I step in the gap to help him to what? Increase his faith. Yeah. Yes. This is what Jesus said. If you stay focused on me, mm -hmm. I will show you how to increase your faith in me. Mm -hmm. And the only way you can do that to increase your faith in me, you got to read me. Because mm -hmm. I'm talking to you through my mm -hmm. words. Mm -hmm. My word is me. Mm -hmm. See, people take the Bible like it just Something to read. But actually, the word is Jesus. He actually talking to you. It's just how you take the Bible. People take the Bible read in something deep. Oh, I'm going deep in the word. I'm deep. It ain't about deep. It's about to know him. Who he is.
my God. That was about making sense. Mm -hmm. Oh, my God, my God. Y'all see it? He said, oh, a look of faith. My God, my God. Thank you, Jesus. Then he arose and rebuked the winds and the sea. And there was a great calm. That is a greater calm. It did, he called you more. He said, a greater calm. Stuff that used to bother you, it won't bother you no more. Amen. You done got that peace within you that the peace of God rested. Where folks used to talk about you, where you used to try to bend your back. Amen. You don't do that no more. You look at that ain't what I don't know why I ain't got to go through that. Mm -hmm. I think about stupid stuff we did. Mm -hmm. Hey, stupid. You did say the things and stuff you did. Mm -hmm. And it was stupid. Mm -hmm. yeah. Real stupid. When I was talking to you tonight about uh, women with babies, mm -hmm. they get out here and fight another woman about a man, about the baby, mm -hmm. who the baby daddy is. Mm -hmm. They done been DA. Yeah. They, they don't give the DA. Right. He'll tell who the daddy is. Yeah. So you don't want to get out here and go to jail. Right. <laughs> right. And then they do that. I understand, many people are in prison over foolish Stop. I ain't got to fight. He's a big DNA. I ain't got to do it. I want to prove something. I do my dog treasure. Tamika, take uh, to make that. The one that's supposed to be your daddy wasn't that daddy. When the DNA come back, it wasn't that daddy. So, hey, just for the next day. <laughs> come on, y'all. I'm being honest. I'm being fair to you. If you can't do that, of being stormy. Right, yes. Do what you got to do. Because right. you can't make free with everybody. Right. Yes. This is what Jesus is saying. It get calm. Yes. I don't care how I'm going to feel about you, you will come. Right. When you losing your sleep, you come. Mm -hmm. Jesus done calm your storm. Because you stay focused. My God. My God, my God. Something you just got to do yeah. to stay focused. Uh -huh. So the way got calm. Y'all see that? Yeah. So their faith was lit. But you know, you think about Mother Seed. It grows to be the biggest tree. Mm -hmm. I think that remember I gave y'all what Mother Seed mm -hmm. is a little bit of thing. Ain't big as nothing. But when it grows, his branches and birds under the sea, he was that mustard seed. So the more you allow him to lay inside of you, the bigger he get. The bigger your problem gets, the bigger his power, he moves. He comes in the supernatural. A great anointing in, his, in him, so in you, that when you walk by the grocery store, the enemy be in there and they say, Why are you tormenting me for my time? <laughs> See, he want to get you like that. So, just like it was in the Bible day, you go in that word and you see that woman, she been but said by then, you just walk down and say, leave her. Mm -hmm. Keep walking, doing your work. Yeah. Yeah. I, 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 I believe that. Amen. <laughs> I believe for his own will. Y'all yeah. <laughs> see that? Mm -hmm. he, the focus was in the ship. Mm -hmm. What I'm trying to tell you, the focus is in your problem. Yes. Mm -hmm. Your problem, he's in. Mm -hmm. See, you can't see the problem. You see the problem, not the problem solved. Because you're looking at the problem. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
He's in you. He's in your ship. He in your problem. Let me, he's right in the dead of it. He just getting it set up so he can get it all. So you want, my God, he ain't talking now again. You remember when the children of Israel came out of Egypt, mm -hmm. Pharaoh was behind him. The Red Sea was before him. What? All God told Moses, stretch forth the road. Yes. And he parted what? Yes. See, they were in the center of that rock. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The sea was in front of them. Pharaoh, they was behind them. So they was in the center. They was. But Jesus was in the center too. What he did was, he stepped around them. Out. And stepped in front. He stepped in front. So they couldn't touch them. They had to face him. Mm -hmm. Come on, y'all. Y'all mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. So your problem is no problem. Mm -hmm. All he's saying, your problem is behind you. Mm -hmm. they talking about you in front of you. Yeah. But I'm right there in the center. Mm -hmm. So when the time comes, they come around you. I'm going to step in. Front of you. <laughs> now what you gonna do? What you gonna do? Come on. And he wiped them all out. Sometimes God wants to, you to stay focused to wipe out all your enemies so you don't have to see that no more. Yeah. Sometimes you ain't gonna see no more. Yeah. You ain't gonna have to deal with it no more. Mm -hmm. God. Mm -hmm. Oh my Lord, let me get in the fan. Let me get in the fan. I need a drink. I need a drink. Y'all seem like y'all ain't getting it ready. I need a drink. Come on. Give me a drink. Give me a drink. See, you won't have to deal with that no more. Come on now. He wants, sometimes he wants to kill every one of your enemies. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. He killed every one of them. If you stay focused. I thought I was share was talking about that man with aggravating on job. God moved him. Amen. Thank you. God will move him. Yes, he will. If you stay focused. Yes, he will. Oh, yes. Ooh, the ball. Yes, he will. 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 Yes, He's talking about them. To let you know, he's the folk. He said, folk, this is what they were saying, Jesus, but Jesus wants you to know this. He gave me focus, focus, he cares. <laughs> Jesus is the folk. He's the one who's on the ship. Common sense will tell you if he ain't sleep. If he's sleep. Why you disturbed? Right. Right. If he ain't moved, I hear the Holy Ghost. I hear. If he ain't moving, and he still, you wonder why your prayers ain't answered? Cause he ain't worried about it. He just sleep right now. He's working it out. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. You want Lord ain't got no answer yet. What's going on? <laughs> you gonna let the 